Subscribe to Rajshree Food and click on the bell icon for more updates. It's summer and vacation time, and moms always need recipes that are quick and easy in their bank, which are healthy as well as delectable to the child's palate. So, something as simple as a fruit custard is today's recipe. So, let's begin. Let's start with boiling three cups of full-fat milk. Let's turn on the flame. Let's bring this to a boil. Once the milk starts boiling, let's add in some sugar. So I'm going to add five tablespoons of sugar and keep stirring till the sugar dissolves. While the sugar and milk is boiling, let's mix four tablespoons of custard powder in a cup of normal milk. So I have some custard powder. It's just plain vanilla custard powder. Give this a good mix. Make sure there are no lumps in the milk and now let's pour this into this hot milk. Keep stirring because the milk is going to start thickening up as it comes to a boil again. The milk has started to thicken. Keep stirring and let it cook for another 2 minutes. This is the consistency of the custard that I need. And now, let's add in 1 tablespoon of vanilla essence. Let's give this a mix. And now, let this cool down for at least 10 minutes before we add in the fruits. You will need to stir this periodically as it's cooling down because I don't want it to set outside. Now this is done, let's add in the fruits. Into this, I'm going to add half a banana chopped. Let's add in half an apple chopped. One cup of green grapes that I've cut into half. And also, I'm going to add one cup of black grapes that I've cut into half. Some pomegranate. And now, let's give this a mix. Also to make it a little more rich, I'm going to add in 3 tablespoons of fresh cream. This is entirely optional, so if you have it at home, you can add some. This is done and I'm going to quickly serve it. And now this needs to refrigerate for at least 2 hours before serving. So let's put it in the fridge. This is nicely chilled and set. And now let's garnish it. Since I've not added any oranges, I'm going to drizzle a little bit of orange crush on top just to garnish it. Garnish with some almond flakes, pistachio flakes, some grapes and some pomegranate seeds. As you can see, with minimal cooking, you can come up with something so delicious. You can add in any fruits as you like and do try this at home. Comment below and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.